One day after three people were found shot to death in Louisville, their sus suspected killer Christopher Olivo is behind bars 900 miles away in Florida. Police discovered the horrific scene Friday evening in the 6400 block of Venango Drive in PRP. Our Dennis Ting has more on the suspect and what police found when they caught him. I'd like to figure out, you know, why, you know, what would make somebody want to do that. It's a question on the minds of many. One day after police found two women and a man dead inside a home in the 6400 block of Venango Drive, a typically quiet neighborhood in Pleasure Ridge Park. The only thing I hear are sirens, like when they're going to Greenbelt, but I've never, I've never really had anything this bad. This neighbor, who has to remain anonymous, says she first heard the news Friday afternoon while at work, seeing video of her neighbor's home on television. I just immediately started praying because I knew there were children in that house. And when they said there were three, that really upset me. Police say they found 39 year old Geneva Miles, 27 year old Mike Miles and 23 year old Catherine Miles shot multiple times. Police also found two children in the home unharmed. A family of the friend told WHAS 11 Friday evening he had known them for about two years. They were good people. They were outgoing. I mean, they always had a good attitude. They'd always make you laugh. I didn't know them. The people very well. I mean, they were very nice. They always waved, but knowing that all, there were all these adults around here and there were children in there by themselves and none of us knew to help them, it makes it makes me very sad. Officers arrested 46-year-old Christopher Olivo in Florida Friday evening, charging him with three counts of murder and one count of tampering with evidence. Police say he was found wearing a ballistic vest with an AK-47 in the car. This picture of Olivo was posted by one of his victims, Geneva Miles, on Facebook last August. The two had a daughter together, and police say they found the two-year-old with him, unharmed. You know, they were just going on about their life and going to work and, and raising kids, and, and all of a sudden, they don't have that anymore. Dennis Ting, WHAS 11 News. Thank you, Dennis. LMPD is sending officers from the homicide unit to Florida where Olivo is being held. LMPD is expected to release more information about this case on Monday.